simama mkashangilia wakati washindani hao wanaingia katika huu mpambano. Haleluya! Okay, swali la kwanza. Nisomee andiko kutoka katika kitabu cha Yeremia 31 mstari wa 33 mpaka 34. Ukipata unasoma. Yeremia Jeremiah 31 verse 33 to 34. 31 verse 33 to 34. Ukipata wewe soma tu. Bali agano hili ndilo litakalofanya nyumba ya Israeli baada ya siku zile asema Bwana. Haleluya! Wanaume ngapi? Wanaume mbona msimami? Nahitaji mnywani I need spectacles. I cannot see today. I have an issue with my eyes today. Women, don't worry. I got this. Wanaume, shangilieni ushindi wenu. Moja! Woo! Swali la pili. Nisome andiko kutoka kitabu cha Petro wa kwanza, sura ya kwanza mstari wa tatu. First Peter, chapter chapter 1 verse 3. Chapter 1 verse 3 Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ in his great mercy has given uh, he's given unto us All right Nimeisha lakini nimeshinda right Okay Wanawake ngapi Kwa hiyo ni moja kwa moja Bado pointi tatu umezani bado tunaenda kuona Leo wana moto kweli kweli wanaume wako active wanawake wako active celebrate Jesus somebody Ya tatu Ha hebu mtu mmoja vuta pumzi maana hii ah, ah. nifungulie ni andiko kutoka katika kitabu cha Sefania sura ya tatu mstari wa 16 Sefania sura ya tatu mstari wa 16, mstari wa Sefania, sura ya tatu, mstari wa 16 mpaka 17 Sefania Alafu nani nani usiangalie mwanzo. Look at Madevu akienda mwanzo kule kuangalia. Sefania sura ya tatu, mstari wa 16 mpaka 17. Verse 16 it says on that day they will say to Jerusalem Wanawake ngapi? Wanaume ngapi? Tulia, tulia hapa. Wanawake ana point ngapi? Bado point mbili. Hallelujah. Madevu unasema? Soma, soma twende. Okay. Kitabu kinachofuata. Nisome andiko kutoka katika kitabu cha Nahum moja. Nahum sura ya kwanza mstari wa saba mpaka wa nane. Nahum. Where are you Nahum? Jamani nimefika moja, saba mpaka nane. Huu mchezo unahitaji hasira. Unahitaji kitabu kingine sana. Na huu mjumbe. Na huu moyo. Shangilieni, shangilieni mnaotaka washinde wanawake siwasikii. Na huu ngapi? Na huu mmoja, mstari wa saba mpaka wa nane. Yesu. Na huu mmoja ngapi? Na huu mmoja. Na ngapi? Saba mpaka nane. The Lord is good a refuge in times of trouble. My God. Read the entire verse 7 to 8. All right, verse 7 to 8 and it says, "The Lord is good a refuge in times of trouble. He cares for those who trust in him. But with an overwhelming flood, he will make an end of me. There he will pursue his force into the realm of darkness." Hii Biblia inatereza karatasi sana. Wanawake ngapi? Wanaume ngapi? Anyway. Anyway. We mean business. Let's go Julia. Ya mwisho. All right. Au bonus question leo. Eh. Tuweke bonus. Hata ukeka bonus tatu haizi pata. Okay. Tumeongeza bonus. Wangapi wanaume mnataka bonus? Wanaume kama vile washashindwa. Okay. Ya mwisho. Nisome andiko kutoka kitabu cha Yuda. Sura ya kwanza mstari wa 24 mpaka 25. Is that in the New Testament or what? I don't know. <laughs> Judah. 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 Yuda. 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 
Sura ya kwanza 24 mpaka 25. We Jude ngapi? Sura ya kwanza 24 mpaka 25. So him who yeah, is yeah, able to keep you from stumbling into the presence of the tie. It's a tie. Wow. It's a tie. 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 Asema ukweli ni mpenzi wa Mungu. Yes, I said it first. Mtu mmoja. Ah ah aniambie. <laughs> Nani ameanza kusoma wa kwanza? Baba yangu hapa ni msema kweli siku zote. Hajasikia. Unampa nafasi. Atuambie alisikia sauti ya nani ya mwanamke au ya mwanaume ya kwanza? Ameanza wote. Hapana. No. It's a tie. No 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 Juliet it's not a tie. We can go back on YouTube, play it back, and let's hear it. We can do that. Tuko live was safi. Tunaweza kuingia kwenye sim tukaangalia. Hapana, hapana chatai wala sweta. Producer, atusaidie. Ni tie ama sio tie? Kuna maisha kwa magumu. Nimeshauriwa njia nzuri zaidi. Ehe. Watakaopiga sauti kuu ndio watakuwa wamochukua ushindi. Nianze na wanawake. Ah wanawake ni wengi zaidi. Wanawake pigeni kelele. Bas. Wanaume pigeni kelele. Ah. Wanawake wamechukua. Haya, hamna shida. 